Mentoring and coaching are vital components of medical education, serving as the backbone for developing competent and compassionate healthcare professionals. These approaches foster an environment where students feel supported and guided through their educational journey. Effective mentoring establishes strong relationships grounded in trust and respect, enabling mentors to inspire and motivate their mentees to reach their full potential in both personal and professional domains. The mentoring process typically follows a three-phase model, preparation, development, and sustainability. During the preparation phase, mentors and mentees establish clear expectations and objectives. This initial step is crucial, as it lays the foundation for open communication and effective feedback. Mentors guide their mentees in setting realistic goals and navigating challenges, ensuring a tailored approach that resonates with each individual's needs and aspirations. A well-defined plan increases the likelihood of success and enhances the mentee's commitment to their learning. The development phase focuses on nurturing skills and competencies essential for medical practice. Through constructive feedback and reflective discussions, mentors provide insights that encourage mentees to think critically and self-assess their progress. This phase emphasizes experiential learning, allowing mentees to apply theoretical knowledge to real-world scenarios. Role-playing, case analyses, and clinical simulations serve as effective tools in this stage giving students the opportunity to hone their decision-making, communication, and empathy skills under the watchful eye of experienced mentors. Finally, the sustainability phase ensures that the mentorship relationship continues to evolve and adapt even after formal training ends. This long-term relationship can evolve into a professional network that supports career development and lifelong learning. Implementing regular follow-ups, peer mentoring, and alumni connections fosters a sense of community and belonging. Mentors who actively engage in their mentees' continuing education demonstrate a commitment to their growth that extends beyond medical school. By cultivating an ongoing dialogue, mentors create a safe space for mentees to seek advice and share experiences as they encounter challenges in their careers. The GROW model is a coaching framework that helps individuals set and achieve goals. It is particularly useful for mentoring and coaching conversations as it provides a structured approach to exploring challenges and developing solutions. Here's a breakdown of the GROW model. Hersing goal. What is the goal? The first step is to clearly define the desired outcome. This should be specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound, smart. Why is this goal important? Understanding the motivation behind the goal can help maintain focus and commitment. The reality. Where are you now? This involves assessing the current situation, including strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats. What is the current situation? This involves identifying any obstacles or challenges that may hinder progress towards the goal. I get options. What are your options? This step involves brainstorming potential solutions or strategies to overcome obstacles and achieve the goal. What are the pros and cons of each option? Evaluating the potential benefits and drawbacks of each option can help make informed decisions. The way forward, and what will you do? This final step involves creating a specific action plan with clear steps and deadlines. When will you do it? Setting specific timelines can help keep you accountable and motivated. Benefits of using the GROW model in mentoring. Clarity and focus. The GROW model helps both the mentor and mentee to stay focused on the desired outcome empowerment. By asking powerful questions, the mentor empowers the mentee to discover their own solutions. Accountability. The action plan developed in the way forward step helps to keep the mentee accountable for their progress. Positive mindset. The GROW model encourages a positive and solution-focused approach to challenges. Tips for effective GROW mentoring. Active listening. Pay close attention to the mentee's responses and ask clarifying questions. Open-ended questions. Use open-ended questions to encourage, in conclusion, implementing effective mentoring and coaching approaches in medical education significantly enhances student learning outcomes and professional growth. It serves to cultivate a new generation of healthcare professionals who are not only skilled in their practice but also committed to the principles of empathy and patient-centered care. As medical education continues to evolve, the importance of mentorship remains a fundamental element in shaping the future of healthcare.